Here we are at Oracle Park, home of the first place San Francisco Giants. Today they are going for the sweep of the Crosstown rivals, the Oakland Athletics. This is the first series in San Francisco this year to be played at full capacity. More than 100,000 fans are expected over the course of the three-game Bay Bridge series. We arrived about an hour and a half before the 1 o'clock first pitch. We parked in Lot A, which is about a 10 minute walk from the entrance. Parking was $50. If you want to save money, take Caltrain. The station is a few blocks from the park. Any ticket holders will be allowed inside of Oracle Park. No proof of vaccination or negative COVID test is required. While face masks are still recommended, particularly for unvaccinated fans or in indoor areas, there is no requirement for any fans to wear masks at any time. We bought our tickets on the MLB Ballpark app. You show your electronic tickets via the app, which are scanned when you enter. You can also transfer tickets to other people in your party via the app. Here is a great view of the Bay Bridge from left field. Oracle Park remains cashless, meaning only credit and debit cards may be used to purchase concessions. The park has a wide variety of food, from your typical hot dogs and pretzels, to poke, boba, crab rolls, and Filipino lumpia, which are mini egg rolls. There are more food options on the lower level, and not all food vendors were open. Lines for food were long, I recommend getting food before first pitch, and not during the game. The Coca-Cola fan lot is located inside the park, just behind the left field bleachers. It features a 47 foot high slide in the shape of a Coke bottle that lights up with every Giants home run. The fan lot also features a 26 foot tall replica of a 1927 baseball glove and a miniature version of the stadium. Unfortunately, the Coca-Cola fan lot was closed for this weekend's series. The upper deck is lined with pictures of Giants greats like Willie Mays, Willie McCovey, and Will Clark. There are life-size models made of Legos of Madison Bumgarner and Buster Posey in the upper deck. On game days, fans in boats and kayaks wait in the Covey code for a splash hit, which is a home run that lands in the water on the fly. These hits are tallied on an electronic counter on the right field wall. Fun fact, as of June 2021, no right-handed hitter has ever hit an opposite field home run into the Covey Cove, though Giants catcher Buster Posey has come close several times.